So what should our adversaries know about the Gerald Alf Ford? One of the many missions of the ship is deterrence. So when the adversaries have an aircraft carrier like this patrol their waters, they know that the United States is serious. Deterrence fails, diplomacy fails, and our civilian leaders need to have someone punch an adversary in the mouth. This is the ship to do it. You know, every day there's something new going on that's a first in class. You know, we, we say as Ford sailors a lot, uh, we speak to our, our role as being first in class. Well, here today, every day, we are setting that standard. Uh, not just for ourselves, but we are baselining the class for the next 70 years. The ship was designed about 15 or 20 years ago when the Navy recognized that our adversaries were starting to ramp up their strategic priorities. And knowing that, we had went to our first new aircraft carrier design in 40 plus years. You know, personal opinion, I think what we're doing here on Ford is more technically complex than the Apollo program. You look at the breadth and depth of the technical challenges that we're taking on, and then we, the sailors on this ship, have to operationalize that and make something that's sailor-proof. That's the process we're going through right now. So it is, it is very hard. We have high aspirations. And, and frankly, America's right to expect a lot of us. Everyone is coming together now because we're out here doing the thing we're built to do. And it's really a great experience to do that. We're not, we're not just sitting in the shipyard, uh, you know, hoping and, and doing the daily upkeep maintenance that our ship still demands, but we're here doing the mission that motivates us. We could have our kids' kids operating from this class of ship uh, in the far future of our Navy and our nation. We get to be part of that on the ground floor and build upon the 70 plus year legacy uh, of modern carrier aviation. That's really cool.